What's up Lego fans, it's Ben here from JB Bricks, and here I've got a Lego Star Wars set. This is the AAT set 75080, and it has 251 pieces. So, Lego has done a lot of versions of this particular thing. This one is the smallest, but I think, personally, that it is the coolest. Now, a lot of people are going to disagree with me on that because it is small, it is somewhat out of scale, but I think it still looks really good and captures all the important details of it. So, first of all, let's take a look at the main AAT. So, here's the main build, the AAT. It's, it looks very nice. There's a ton of detail on it. There is a one downside that I think is the only downside, or actually I think there's another that I dislike, but that one major downside for me is that these side cannons right here don't rotate at all. They're fixed. So, but it is very easy to fix. I fix. I haven't tried it, but I know for a fact that it will be easy to fix if you don't want the or if you want to make those able to rotate up and down. So that is easy to fix. So not that big of an issue. The other issue I've got is. <clears throat> Everyone knows a droid will sit in there, and there's just nothing. They could have probably put like a little control pad or something there, but they didn't. It would have been just one extra part, and it's just, again, not a super big one downside, but I still think LEGO could have done better. The big top turret rotates around like you probably already saw. You've got the big cannon which can move up and down. So that's nice. And in there, there's the, where your top gunner would sit. And you can take your droid, fold his leg, whoops his arm fell off so fold his legs and sit him in there which is a pretty good look and if you want you can even fold his head down oh, whoops. Hmm. you need to fold yeah there you can fold him all the way completely whoops completely uh, into his co most compact form and he will fit so then you can just open the top and he, well, he can pop out so that's pretty good and if you want you can even stuff his gun in there with him so that's pretty nice and also with this hat you can open Take your other droid included with the set, fold his legs up, sit him in there. Whoops. Sit him in there like so. And he can be driving the whole thing. And you don't have to fold his head down to close the hatch like you do with the gunner but actually the hatch folds his head down for you so you can just quickly do that so and then coming around to the back there is some more detail I think that's pretty cool and then under here you see those and you probably saw on the front the two spring-loaded shooters so the way you activate those is I'm just gonna fold him down 
is you take it and just push up and I just fired one off and then you I didn't get the best for some reason they're not working for me a ton but that other one fell on the floor so I'll have to go get that in a minute but it overall it's a pretty nice build I really like it they could have probably done some stickers right here to resemble the bigger guns but not too big of an issue because you have the actual shooters so that's pretty nice so now let's move on to the main figures so the three main figures included with the set left to right is a regular battle droid with his regular blaster a pilot battle droid with his pistol and Jar Jar Binks with his shield and stick with blue orb on top which I'm drawing a blank what they're called I forget so you've got the three main figures the battle droids are the same as we've gotten before just fold their head down you can fold them all the way into their tightest form like so so just super simple it's just the same one we've always gotten before I believe but then Jar Jar Binks somewhat well there's quite pretty little printing on his torso I'll remove his stuff so you can see so there's it bear his torso printing so there's that and then but spin him around to the back you can see on the back of his head the printing is just phenomenal oops focus camera the printing is just phenomenal it's, the camera's having a hard time focusing in see it oh, right there is where it's getting blurry but yeah the printing is just phenomenal as you can see it's just really nice I love it but then just on the front of his head plain and simple like we've gotten before so yeah that was main figs now let's get on to my thoughts about the set so overall very nice set I definitely give it two thumbs up if JB Bricks were to rate this on a scale of 1 to 10 it'd probably be a 7 six to seven so yeah it's pretty good it's good price for what you're getting it's just a nice set it comes it has only really one print besides Jar Jar Binks it the, and that's his shield you could count that as a part of him but I don't really just a really nice print on the shield I really like it it's, de it's is kind of exclusive to the gun gans but it's pretty cool you can use it for a number of mocks so yeah that was my review of this set I hope you liked it if you're new to the channel subscribe and check back for more videos soon because there's always more on the way so catch you later